How's it going people, Bobby here once again. You might know me online as Ironhammer5 and today I've got some uh, juice reviews for you and these are a few juices from Liquid E-Juice. Uh, their website is liquidejuice.com. They even sent me a shirt, check that out. Um, you can't really see it on the video but I thought I'd show it to you quickly. <laughs> um, they sent me eight of their juices. I'm going to do three in this video. I've got Loop Shake, Funnel Cake, and they rhyme, and Morning After, which really doesn't rhyme. Um, so uh, I'm going to take a look at Morning After first, and we're going to get to the juice, but let's take a very quick look at the bottles. So I've got 15 ml bottles here. They're little glass dropper bottles, uh, the ones you used to see in with a childproof cap. Uh, you can see on the front they've got the cool liquid e-juice label. They've got this kind of like metallic finish to the labels, with like a global earth kind of pattern in the background which you can kind of make out there uh, three milligram not for resale because these were free samples uh, 15 mil there's liquidegeist.com on the side this one is morning after uh, you've got all the usual warning stuff like that warning signs down the side uh, there is an expiration date on the top which is always cool to see it helps people know if they've found something in their cupboard that's been there they can kind of figure out how long it's been there for um, but yeah nice bottles overall uh, they look really nice the labels are really nice they're very well done uh, very impressed with the presentation of it. So let's get to vaping it, shall we, guys? Um, first up, I have a mod that's covered in juice, which I'm now going to wipe on my shirt. Just for Kathy, who I know is watching out there. Sorry, Kathy. Um, morning after, let's drip a little bit of this. So they did send me this uh, like menu card thing that's laminated here, in case you get juice all over it. And morning after says you're drifting off to sleep, wrapped in a warm fleece blanket. And then it says, morning after is all about comfort. The perfect marriage of crumbled maple, oatmeal, and smooth butterscotch mixed into milk with a mild suggestion of banana on top. So that's what this one's supposed to be. Uh, I have been vaping these, so I've already tasted them. So I uh, don't necessarily need to tell you what it is. Uh, it does match the description, for sure. Uh, I don't really notice milk as such, but um, here we go. The butterscotchy caramelly taste I get, really, really strong. And it kind of masks the other flavors at first. And it kind of goes really butterscotchy caramelly flavored. Um, and it's kind of like that American caramel flavor. Like over here, our caramel is much more like buttery and creamy, um, at least in my experience. Uh, but like the butterscotch like, and like syrupy flavor more that you guys have in the US um, is what I get from this. Um, really loads of that and then straight after that you get vanilla and then right at the end the banana comes in and I love the little touch of banana right at the end and it's like a fresh banana it's not like a candy banana flavor it's like a real banana this one uh, it's a really nice flavor exactly as it matches the description but personally um, that butterscotch is too much for me. It's a real, really strong flavour, and uh, I couldn't vape it all the time. I love the banana and vanilla part though. It's good. It's good. Um, so next up, I'm going to do funnel cake, and uh, this is one that I actually quite like. Uh, it's a vanilla and strawberry cake. The description says, as I'm trying to put my velocity on it, velocity cane, guys. It's fucking awesome. I see what the hype is about. Um, if I can find it on the list, funnel cake, just hook it up to my veins. Uh, it's a fluffy, freshly made waffle topped by creamy vanilla ice cream, powdered sugar, juicy strawberries, and a generous layer of whipped cream. Um, and to me, I don't necessarily get all those flavors. I don't necessarily get the uh, waffle flavor or like, it's called funnel cake, right? Well, I don't really get much of a cakey, waffly flavor. Um, what I do get is strawberry and vanilla, and uh, that's the kind of thing I like to vape. Uh, if you've seen my previous videos and my own recipes and stuff, um, strawberry and vanilla is something that I do enjoy. And what I like about this one is, it's not really custardy. Um, I like custard, but uh, I like the fact this is a bit different. And I like the fact that it's more of a kind of faint flavor. It's not really in your face. A lot of their other flavors are like really, really overpowering, um, but this one is much more like lighter flavored, and I get vanilla, loads of vanilla, and sweet, 
fresh strawberries. It's really, really nice, and it's really, really, um, just really nice. It is something that I can vape all the time. It's my kind of flavour. That's all I can say, really. Strawberries and vanilla. Um, say, I don't get the waffle. I can't. I can't pick that out. I get a little bit of that sugary taste that they talk about, I guess. Powdered sugar. But uh, I really don't notice any waffle. I get vanilla, cream, and I get strawberry. And it's really tasty. Um, but really not, not a strong strawberry. Not like a milkshake. It's like just a nice vanilla, pure vanilla strawberry flavor. Um, so next up, I'm just going to try and burn the rest of this off very quickly. And because I know this next flavour is going to completely dominate on top of that one, so I'm not going to bother re-wicking. I've been tasting it. There's not much of this next one left. Left. It's my favourite one I've tried. Um, so I'll be right back. So I'm back, people, and I'm about to put Loop Shake on. And this is my favourite one of their juices. Um, it's really, really yummy. And the description says, "Oh, by the way, I'm not sure what the VGPG ratios of these are because uh, it doesn't say on the bottle anywhere. But um, I, I'm guessing they're like 70-30." Um, just from sort of previous experience, that's what it seems like to me. Uh, well, I'm not I'm not absolutely certain on that. But Loop Shake is breakfast time. Sunday morning cartoons, rainbow dyed milk. Relive your use with this tangy and familiar flavour, which combines your favourite fruity cereal with a hint of rich blueberry. The sharp beginning is complemented by a milky finish, and. Uh, the flavour of this is like, I can't really even describe it to be honest. Um, apart from saying it's really, really tasty. Um, if you imagine like the milk that you get after Fruit Loops, but imagine if you could um, sort of up the ratio of Fruit Loop to milk, so like it was really, really flavourful, like the fruit part and less of the milk. It's definitely milky and creamy. And it's really, really fruity. And right at the end, there's this sugary, absolutely lovely flavor, which is almost sherbet-y, like a rainbow sherbet or something. But um, I vape nearly the whole bottle, and I'm still struggling to get my head around what flavor it is. Um, it's not exactly just like the milk from Fruit Loops. It's got more to it than that. Um, it's a very kind of like artificial flavor. But it's goddamn delicious. Like I could vape this forever and ever and ever. The only thing is that uh, the flavour is so strong that I find that it kind of kills my taste buds a little bit. Like if I vape too much of it, it really starts to taste like nothing. I know that can happen with every juice, but uh, it seems to happen much quicker with this juice. But uh, the taste of it is absolutely lovely, and. Um, I'm glad that I've made this video now because it means I can vape the little tiny bit what's left in there because I've been saving it until I made this review. Um, so for the next probably half an hour before that's gone, if that, um, that's what I'll be vaping in my Velocity, which I'm absolutely loving too. There'll be a review of that coming up very soon. But cheers for hanging out with me, guys. To wrap up Liquid E-Juice, um, those three flavors and all the other ones I've tried, to be honest, are really nice. Um, they're all kind of pretty much accurate to the flavor descriptions couple maybe a little bit like that funnel cake I really can't tell the waffle in it but um, it's still a really nice juice uh, I couldn't complain about any of them the only one I haven't tried is cowboy which is their tobacco flavor they did send it to me but I don't vape tobacco so um, yeah I'm not going to be trying that one uh, I'll probably give it to a friend or something who likes tobacco juice um, so yeah thanks to them for sending this over cheers for the t-shirt I guess can't have too many t-shirts right um, thanks to everyone out there for watching um, you're all fucking awesome as always don't forget to subscribe, like, comment, tell me if you've tried these juices, I'd love to hear about it. Um, somewhere in the UK needs to start stocking this loop shake shit because uh, I need more of it. So, um, take care guys, thanks all for watching, I'll see you all very soon. And bye bye!